Mr. Simon. Oh, cheers, Rick. You're welcome. Here we go. Thank you. Anything interesting in the paper then, Ian? Yeah, there's an article here about Scott's Antarctic expedition. Mm -hmm. There was a Pompey sailor called Ted McKenzie who sailed aboard. He's got some of his memoirs in here. Oh, what does it say? Twas on the glorious 1st of June, the time well never mind. The Terra Nova sailed from port, our friends we left behind. Three rousing cheers they gave us that filled our hearts with pain. And often as I sit and think, I hear those cheers again. Years have passed since we set sail on our southern mission. God rest the souls of those who died on the glorious expedition. I never shall forget that day, no matter where I go. When I left my home, a comfort for the land of ice and snow. And the brewers on Dunedin kindly sent us down some beer. Three large and welcome barrels that gave the crew some cheer. The captain had no room on board, the barrels we couldn't store. And every eye was filled with tears as we put the beer ashore. Just three days out from New Zealand, we struck a terrible gale. The Terra Nova laboured on without a stitch of sail. How the ship lived through that storm is a thing I cannot say. For her rigging was all broken and the bulwarks washed away. Years have passed since we set sail on our southern mission. God rest the souls of those who died on the glorious expedition. I never shall forget that day, no matter where I go. When I left my home, a comfort for the land of ice and snow. Off her course, the ship was blown a hundred miles away. But good luck did not leave us, we struck ice a Christmas day. The Terra Nova broke the ice, once more she was free. With steam and sail, she struggled on towards the southern sea. The great ice barrier left behind, we sailed towards the land. The scenery magnificent, the air just simply grand. The sun was shining brightly, and although it's strange to say, it was just like dear old England on a bright midwinter's day. Years have passed since we set sail on our southern mission. God rest the souls of those who died on the glorious expedition. I never shall forget the day, no matter where I go. When I left my home of comfort for the land of ice and snow. The ship now in McMurdo Sound, a nicely sheltered place. We called the spot Cape Evans, and this we called the base. Here we found a landing place most suitable for us. Under the splendid shelter of the great man Erebus. When all our stores were landed and everything was done, the captain thanked us heartily, shook hands with everyone. Oh, the wilderness they bravely trod, they tracked both far and wide. But there too late, death sealed their fate. They died, yes, side by side.